Bloggers, welcome back to the channel. I'm Belitra and I'm the Crafty Black Girl. So you guys, we got another basket video. This is so long overdue, you guys. So yeah, I'm just showing you guys, starting out, how I stuff the baskets. You guys have probably seen this a million gazillion times, but for those who have not, this is how I start off the base of my basket. This one, I rolled it and you will see exactly why. So I'm gonna take this little knife and I'm gonna cut in side and as you see i rolled it like a donut kind of so that i could fit this inside and i wanted to go into the middle so that it i can build around it so then i just took this dr teal's little set got that for 50 cents from dollar general y'all and we're gonna put this on the back side of the basket of course i'm going to use my skewers as i always do i'm not gonna worry about the skewers sticking up as you can see before i turned it that they were still sticking up so i went ahead and just taped that and then now i'm going to remove this price tag you guys if you shop at city trends that's the only thing i really 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 hate about city trends is their tags are almost impossible to get off so <clears throat> just keep that in mind if you're shopping at city trends you guys you gonna have a hard time so most of these items did come from city trends and this is like a spa relaxation basket and so i went ahead and put the little foot thing there this is probably one of the quickest baskets i did but lord knows this is a long overdue basket you guys i was supposed to do this a long long time ago this basket is actually not for sale this is a gift basket you guys and so now i'm gonna take the little soap saver and i'm gonna pop it right on top in the back of the basket and then i thought about it i was like mm, the front's gonna be plain but no because we're gonna have a bow there you guys and we're going to go ahead and tie it up and that is that you guys i actually forgot that i had no more shred but this actually looks like a store basket not that that's always the goal but usually sometimes when i see in the stores they don't really have shred in the basket so it's kind of okay if you don't have shred like you can still do it and this basket has to be shipped so you guys i didn't want to add any extra weight and that is the whole purpose for me using that small basket because when you ship anything it goes by weight so we don't want to make the basket too big too bulky and you know too weighty either so now i'm going ahead and just curling the little string you guys y'all see i made my little struggle bow i gotta get back on practicing but now i'm just curling the extra ribbon from the full bow making sure that they kind of look the same i don't want one to be like wide and one the other but this is what the basket looks like you guys simple easy very quick if you have any questions leave a comment down below until next time stay crafty